Hi friends, today we are going to be making a toucan. So this is the toucan that I drew just earlier. Um, one thing is that it's missing is like a background. So I would suggest for a background you would do like another kind of green. Um, just so it could really f fill the whole page. Um, I got this off of a step-by-step -step sheet I found online. So um, you probably will have access to that. And I do basically the same steps besides the body. I do it a little bit differently. So we're gonna start off by making the tree branch. The tree branch should be a little bit lower than halfway on the paper because we want plenty of room for the toucan. So you're gonna need a pencil um, to do the first steps in. I'm gonna use marker just so you can see better. So I'm gonna have it kind of slopey because I don't want my branch to be perfectly straight. All the branches are gonna look different and that's okay because all branches are a little bit different. Um, then I'm gonna move on to my body. The body is tricky because you don't want to have like a rounded top. You want to have like a flattened top. So you're going to come up, flatten it, and then come back down. Again, it's okay if it's a little bit different. They're all going to look a bit different and that is okay. That what That's what makes your picture, sorry, your drawing, your drawing. So I'm going to start flatten it, come back down. Um, as far as the bill goes, toucans have beautiful, huge bills, and they're all different colors. You want it to start from the top of the head, and you want it to come out. Again, you want this to be big, so you're going to arch it. It's going to dip. I added a little extra dip here. Then you're going to come across, and then the lower part of it. Is gonna come it's just gonna be thinner there okay so um I'm gonna move on to my eye I have one large circle and then a smaller circle inside and then one for the highlight I'm gonna go back later and color that in um I'm gonna put the these little spaces these little details on the bill because toucans, toucans, sorry, have such beautiful bills. They have a bunch of different colors going on and this allows us to, to really fill in with all the colors. I used warm colors. I used orange, yellow, and red, um, but I looked at pictures and it, they have all kinds of colors. They have um, little spots of green, um, some have spots of blue and purple, so feel free to kind of switch up the bill if you want to. But we're going to continue with the line steps first. So we're going to move on to the tail. Just tail is kind of tricky. It's just kind of this whale-like shape, whale tail shape, and then you can add the feet. If the tail doesn't look perfect, that's okay. You can always kind of change the shape of it when you are um, coloring in, okay? Um, on a toucan, you have this black part and then this white. So we're gonna make that area for the white. I started in between the bottom of the bill and like the middle part and I just kind of came around the eye came back up okay so um that's the basic parts of the toucan we're going to move on to adding more to the tree so if you have time you can add extra limbs onto the branches you can add lots and lots of leaves how i did the extra um tree branch up here is I did like a Y shape and just added one in between okay and then add your leaves okay 
Okay, you can add as many as you would like. And then, like I said, you're gonna go back in, color in around the, the highlight of the eye. And um, you can color in the body black. I would use, instead of wasting your marker, your Sharpie juice, you would probably use whatever you're using to color in. For most, it's going to be crayons, um, but if you're doing this at home or something and you're, you have markers, you can use your Crayola marker black to color in so, so you're not taking all your Sharpie away. Um, so yeah, there you have it. Um, I know they're going to turn out awesome and unique. So, looking forward to seeing the results. I'll see you guys later. Bye.